Hi, it's Dr. David Green, founder and CEO of R3 Stem Cell International. One of the questions we get a lot is how our centers treat uh, neurologic diseases in uh, the international centers that we have. Um, and the answer is it's a combination. Um, IV therapies as well as intrathecal and possibly intranasal. So the question that is uh, uh, first should be asked is how do you get a biologic to into the brain cavity, right? Because we have this thing called the blood-brain barrier, which is uh, typically not very permeable to larger uh, cells. So it prevents the biologic elements typically from getting mostly to the brain cavity. So how do you do it? Well, intrathecal application, um, which a lot of people call a lumbar puncture, is a great way to do it. Uh, it's been shown to be very safe in several studies. Um, and basically, it's the same type of way that an anesthesiologist, someone does it on a regular basis. So the patient either uh, sits up and leans forward, or they can lay in a, a fetal type position um, and have it done that way. So if a patient is post stroke and has trouble sitting up, they, they can lay down and it's done just fine. A spinal needle is inserted. Um, and then what will happen is the anesthesiologist um, will, will put it in and then take out the inner catheter and see if some uh, cerebral spinal fluid starts to drip out. If it does, then the anesthesiologist knows that he or she is in the right place, okay? And then <clears throat> the umbilical cord stem cells will be um, uh, very slowly pushed into the um, uh, spinal cord uh, space. Um, and to date, it's a great way to get very high stem cell counts into the intrathecal space um, and into the brain cavity because obviously it connects between the <clears throat> spinal cord and uh, the brain cavity so it can get there nicely. And we've seen tremendous results for patients who have had previous strokes, uh, early stages of Alzheimer's, uh, MS, ALS. Um, now, is it a cure for these conditions? No, it's not. Stem cell therapy in its current state is not a cure for any condition, but it can dramatically help, um, and I go into how it does that in, in other videos. Thanks for watching.